Okay, so this is the next thing. This is um, this is Sage's starter collection. I got this for my birthday from my entire family. It was from like my aunts and uncles, my grandpa, and part of it was from my parents. So it comes with a oh, and I paid for it. Just another part. Of it. So it comes with a Sage paints the sky book. And, um, it's awesome. Like, I, I gotta find the picture. Where's the picture? Oh, oh it's a I see it. Okay, so there's this really awesome picture at the end. That's so pretty. <laughs> Sorry. I'm off in my own world. So, I already opened up some of the stuff. Like, I opened it all up, but I never, like, some things I took out of the packages, like this, because I opened this, I already filmed this, I already filmed this video, but then I had to refilm it, because my camera is dumb sometimes. So, this is her little purse. It opens, it's cute, and it goes with her feet very well. Here's her little necklace, and I have a question. Like, is there supposed to be anything stamped on here? Like, sworn there's supposed to be something stamped on here. I don't know. I'll have to look at the AG website. And if you know, put it down in the comments. Um, because then I'll have to call up AG and tell them that I got the defected necklace. Then I also comes with this cute, um, red bracelet. Super cute. And it also comes with these earrings for the sage. Or any other doll, really. Like, Sage is the first out with your steers, which I'm really happy about. So, that's her accessories. So, the next thing I'm going to open is her sweater outfit. I love this. It's $34, but I bought the entire starter collection. Plus, a few other things. Um, so... This is these sweaters. Super cute and super soft. Like, you've got to go down to the AG store or buy this outfit to feel how soft it is. Like, even if you don't love it, like, it looks so cute. Like, I didn't, like, I wasn't, like, a huge fan of her collection at first. So I was like, eh, it looks like something that, um, I saw my mom wearing. <laughs> like, cause my mom, uh, this looks like something that came from the 70s, little, and then my mom, like, I don't know, just the colors together, and then when I actually saw it, I was like, oh my gosh, this is gorgeous, so I had to have this. So that's the sweater, it also comes with these cute, adorable leggings, and I was wondering if these were just, like, leggings, but like jeggings because like if you look at them they look like jeggings like they have the white on the inside so then once when like the black touches it, it makes it a gray when it stretches I don't know if you can see that here like if you stretch it it turns a different color it's more shiny then and then it comes with this tank top it's very detailed it's like I don't know what to describe it. It looks like something that would be on an old-fashioned building that's really old and really fancy. So, yeah, that looks cute. And then they come with this adorable sandals. There's the next one in here, but I'm not going to show it. But they come with this adorable sandals with the little ruffles in the front. And then it opens in the back like that. And it's so cute. These are to die for. People said that this was like a beige color, but it's more like a light brown. Like, it's not, like people said that it was in, like a nude color, or like a beige or tan, but it's more a light brown, like, I don't know what to describe it. It's not like skin color at all. Um, so, yeah. That's Sage's sweater outfit. So the next outfit that I'm going to open is the Sage's Parade hat and helmet. This, oops, that is kind of veiled. 
Um, this, I wasn't really sure about it. I was kind of iffy. I was like, eh, do I really need it? But I'm glad that I got it because it's super cute. Here's the parade helmet. It came in this wrap, but I took it out already. Um, the reason why I wanted this is because I'm planning on getting Sage's horse for Christmas. So, I don't know how you open this. Like, I've never gotten it open yet. Like, I've tried and tried and tried and tried. I don't know. I'm going to have to figure that out. But it is hard plastic of really good quality. Then there's the hat. And I love the hat. I wasn't sure if I would love the hat in person or anything, but it's super cute. Like, it feels like a felt material with like a lined lining around the edge. Kind of got a little bent here. I don't really care. And then there's got the bead at the bottom. It's a little two knots, not one, two. So that was cute, but it was twenty dollars for two hats which is kind of a lot of money, in my opinion. I don't know, that might just be me. But the next thing that I got is Sage's Parade outfit. Um, this was $34. I was also kind of iffy about this one too, but I actually love this outfit now. Like, I didn't really like it online that much, but when I went and saw it in person, I was like, that's cute. So it comes with these plain pants, which is kind of good. Um, it's like a way different color than the doll pants that she's wearing now. And they're like, they're stretchy a little, like, not much though. Kind of stretchy. Then it comes with this adorable, adorable top. And there's actually like little rhinestones down the side there. I never knew that. And there's the rhinestone buttons, and it opens here, goes all the way down, opens like that. And super cute, but this is kind of thin. I don't really care. It's cute. Um, then it comes with the belt. The belt has designs all around that, and I never knew that. And then it has obviously the design up there, and then it just goes through like that. Kind of. Uh, hard. And then it just have these cute heeled boots that look cowgirl boots. And they're so cute. They got little flowers on the side and everything. Definitely cute and floral. So, yeah. The last thing that I got I cannot open because it is not mine actually. It's Sage's painting set and well, my mom and I bought this together. Um, it was $48, but the reason why we bought it is because next year we're gonna sell it on eBay or towards Christmas time for people to buy if it's like sold out or whatever. So yeah, that's all of Sage's stuff that I got. I also got the doll, but I'm not gonna open that till the end. Like, more. Actually, I decided I'm going to open Sage now because, um, well, um, because she is the last, like, birthday present. She was from my parents, and it says American Girl Sage on her box, and I went through picking all the Sages. Like, one of them had a defected eye, one of them had a defected dress, and yeah, I think my Sage is gorgeous. So, yeah, now I'm going to open her. So she comes with this sage book. Super cute. Super adorable. Can't wait to read it. I'm going to read it before I see her movies. So, I'm just going to show you guys her. It says, adult note. Note? Adult note. To avoid choking hazard, discard rubber bands after opening. And they actually made new ones of these because it says 2013 and it's totally different. So, yeah, Sage's face feels really weird actually. I think she's so pretty. Oh my gosh, her hair is like really different than I expected. Okay, so let's get down to opening her. 
First off, her ring is on the side, so I just wanted to let you guys know that if you're buying her and you don't plan on keeping the box, um, you can always just, well, remember to take out the ring, that's what I meant to say there. Um, so it comes with her box, has obviously the stuff that holds her in, and then it has this thing that holds her neck and supports it. And then she has her boots at the bottom, and this part's kind of hard to open. Oh my gosh, here. I'm going to set her down and open the boots part. Push the camera down a little bit more. So her boots were kind of hard to open. And then for this part, you gotta twist her foot like all the way around to get this part out. You just gotta rip the tape off, I guess. There. Ooh, her boots are cute. Oh my gosh, Sage is cute. I love Sage, oh my gosh. Um, so here's Sage. Oh my gosh, she's so cute. I'm gonna make the box out of there first. Oh my gosh, she's so cute. Um, I'm gonna get situated here for a second. So here's Sage, she's so pretty. Oh my gosh, her eyes are so precious and cute. Her face is so cute. So, I'm just gonna take this off, new one. And her ears are pierced and they do come out. Like that. Ooh, what's inside of her ear? Her ear's all messy. I gotta clean that. Her ear's full of like dust. Ow. Her earring just poked me. Oh, it's so cute. Sage is the first doll with pierced ears. And I think American Girl, they set a high standard with Kanani. So now they have to make the standard higher every single year with the new girl of the year. Like, with kind of they made a doll without part. And Sage, they made a doll with earrings. So, yeah. I'm gonna take off her hairnet now. Oh my gosh. Her hair is so gorgeous. I don't know what this is. Is this a string? That's a string. I'm gonna have to tuck that under her hair. Oh my gosh, her hair is so gorgeous. I love her hair. And then here's her hairnet. Um, Sage is gorgeous. So adorable. I mean, oh my gosh. Her hair, it's so soft. She smells new. I'm gonna grab her ring out of her box. Just so that I don't lose it or anything. I'm gonna put it right on her. Cause Sage wants her ring. Oh my gosh, this is tiny. I can see this is a choking hazard. Or, like, it's gonna get lost really easy. Like, because it, it's like super tiny. Like, here's the palm of my hand. And here it is. It's like really tiny. But then it fits on the doll like that. So cute. Oh my gosh, I love Sage. Like, oh my gosh. I'm gonna go grab Nikki and compare her next to her. Okay, so here's Nikki, and here's Sage, and their hair colors are totally different. Well, they're kind of alike, I guess. I don't know. Yeah, if you want a comparison between the two dolls, um, just put down in the comments that you do, and I will make one. So, yeah, let's move on.